and welcome back. This is Baller Scuba with an episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy. I am joined, as always, by my trusty party of Fallout Luke, Finney, and Nelvin. We are headed north from uh, from the Crescent Lake uh, port. There, taking a look at our world map. Um, yeah, it's gonna be hard to kind of make out. You see that northeastern uh, peninsula, the one that kind of looks like a bird with like the eye in the top right uh we are headed for the yellow dot on the far west i'll show you guys how to get there it's gonna be quite a journey but because it's over sea it's not too tough the enemies on the ocean are not that hard so um yeah let's go that way sounds like fun for everybody doesn't it because if you're like me, you've probably been wondering this whole time, how do I become a wizard or a mage? Uh, from a mage. Because there are certain spells that even our mages can't equip right now, simply because they're not wizards. And so how do you become a wizard? Well, we're going to find that out soon. It won't be in today's video. I'm, you know, I'm not even going to lie. Yeah, we're not even close. Um, but that quest does start right now. And I have no idea how you're supposed to know how to do this. Um, even if you go to the guy now, I say guy, um, even if you go to that part of the world now, he's going to tell you, bring me a token of your valor. Yeah. Could you be a little more specific? No. Bring me a token of your valor. How about just a little hint? No. Bring me a token of your valor. And that's where we're headed right there, the Castle of Ordeals. But as you can see, there's no place to, to land our ship. There's also no place to land the airship. This is why we're taking the ship, though, because we can dock it there and take our canoe. And it's a magic shortcut. And yes, there's plenty of new enemies here. Um... I'm gonna go ahead and use fire two on them because I wish them all to die. Uh, we have saber tooth and lesser tigers. Um, and oh no, the lesser tiger we've seen before. Uh, the were tigers are the ones in the front. The saber tooth is the one on the top left. That ice kind of looking tiger somehow is a saber tooth. The lesser tiger, of course, we fought in Titan's cave. Uh, no. Yeah. There we go. Hopefully that should be enough. Oh, but not if people miss, then it probably won't help. You're not supposed to let these guys get in first. That's just the rules, man. Alright, this should definitely finish off this lesser tiger. And yeah, I don't know why the, the thing that's not considered lesser is the same size as the lesser tiger, but whatever. You take what you can get. Do we have any new enemies? No, just more rare tiger Where tigers. Weird. Now, if you landed with your airship, the closest place you can do is in that top left corner over there, that little patch of land. You cannot land the airship in this marshland here, or in the forests, or on the mountains, or anything like that. Okay, and looks like we're going to make it. Yeah, they can't land on the marshland or the forest or the mountains. It has to be a patch of grass. So I'm going to rest up in a cottage uh, because some of those fights were rather tough. And uh, then we'll move on from there. Okay, into the ca castle. The citadel. Sorry, the citadel of trials. Um, what's up, dude? I, I hast. I didn't know I hast the crown. Okay, sit upon the throne to open the way. If true courage dwells within thee, thou will find proof of it here. Yeah, see, I don't know how you're supposed to know this, but there we go. Um, this will definitely test our valor. Um, I don't see anything. Uh, there was a door up to the left, but I don't see... Uh, yeah, that's the only way we can go. I don't like rooms that aren't symmetrical. It was so close. Oh, here's the throne. And it instantly warps us to the second floor. Awesome. Oh, and there's enemies here. Do we have new enemies? We have Necrotors. Screw it. Everybody attack the first one. <laughs> I don't know how strong these things are. Um, they sound undead. Oh, th they're not too bad. Not too bad. They do a lot of damage. But I'm able to do a lot of damage right back to them, and they go down pretty easy. So, yeah, these little things, they teleport you. 
Um, hold on. Uh, yes. You you take the. I remember there was some trick to this one. Uh, whenever you're given a choice, you take the bottom one every time. Every time. And then, uh, because otherwise they'll warp you backwards, and that's not something you want to do. Holy crap, Medusas. Okay, Medusas can, just like you would think they could, they can stone you. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and use Dia 2 and Fire 2, and hopefully we can kill them before they stone one of us, because stone is not what I want to be right now. They do go down pretty easy, uh, but if you're not willing to use magic against them, run. It's not worth it. Stoning, uh, stone and death is is really tough in this game. So once again, this is the bottom one, so we want to take this one. And then what do we have here? Huh. And more Necrotors. Okay, and I believe... Yeah, this one it leads around to another teleporter. You want to take that one right there. Um, and here we have more mind flares, but we've seen these before. So I know I want to take this bottom one here, but I want to see what's through that door up to the north. Ah, Medusas. Okay, so we want to... Oh my god. Oh, we have... No, we've seen Horned Devils. We've seen them. Yeah, the encounter rate is getting a lot higher in pretty much every dungeon. Okay, so yes, there is a treasure chest here. Um, and I assume that this has to be a scripted battle since they won't let you get it from the side. This is a clay golem. Um, I'm going to say it's weak against ice. Based on what little I know about clay. But it doesn't really matter because he went down with one shot from one of my attackers anyways. And inside we get gauntlets. I assume that is for fallout. Let's see here. No? Nobody? Hmm. That's strange. <laughs> I know what's going on. More Necrotors. Yeah, we'll need to upgrade to, um... To the next stage in order to get those. Okay, so now we're in the third floor of the Citadel of Trials. And we have more treasure! Oh my god, in a nightmare. Why do you make me kill the ponies? I don't want to kill the ponies, but if I don't kill the ponies, they'll kill me. Ah, Finny refused to hit that one. That's what happened right there. Finny refused to hit the nightmare. She does not care. Oh, the healing staff. Okay, uh, you're, if only there was a way for me to to heal everybody without using my magic. Oh, now I have the healing staff. Yay! Is that a scripted battle? I think it is. Weird. Actually, you know what? Let's show off the healing staff in this fight here because it's pretty, pretty simple. I am going to... Damn it. Do I have to change my equipment and then items? How is this done? I'm trying to remember. Yeah, we just used the healing staff. I thought I had to have it equipped, but no. It's, a, it's pretty much a heal spell constantly without using a turn. It's awesome, and you should use it as much as you can. There we go. Ugh, I'm going to need to rearrange that. I do not like it all the way down there if I'm going to be using it constantly, which I probably am. That's going to eliminate a lot of the problems I've been ha having while grinding. Are you guys kidding me? What's with these one-hit combos? No. You know, she's pretty much going to be on healing duty constantly from now on. That's just... Why... Why do you refuse to kill the ponies? I understand why Finny refuses to do it, but everybody else freaking kill the pony. It's gonna s- Ah! Oh, I'm lucky that missed. And that should be enough to kill it. Yeah, why don't you do that the first time? It would've been enough to kill it the first time. So that's the healing staff. It's awesome. Get it. Use it. Constantly. And what do we have here? Steel gloves. Ice Brand again, and the Ruby Armlet. Now I don't remember... Oh! Ruby Armlet is... 
upgraded uh, armlet for uh, pretty much everybody, but it works for the monks, so that's who I'm putting it on now. As you can see, it increases his defense by 9, which is a ton. And that's pretty much it for everybody else right now. Going around the circle, what else we got? More of these, but we've seen these. Do we have more treasure in this corner down here? We do. We have 1,455 gil, a cottage, and 7,340 gil. And of course, of course, the first battle I try to cut out has a new enemy in it. So what I'm going to do here, I do need to heal a bit, so I'm going to use that. Plus, I'm going to bolt three their asses. Because I don't like the look of them. Especially since they all seem to be using fire. They do go down easy enough, but I don't like fire. Fire is bad. So I'm going to use the healing staff and then I'm going to bolt their asses as much as I can. Bolt! Oh, of course, of course they're strong against magic and they're trying to slow me they're trying to slow everybody and it only missed Nervin but then they use it right again I bet this one hits them oh no Nervin cannot be slowed well okay oh no he definitely cannot be slowed um, but yeah that's when you start getting the one hit combos is when uh, when you're slowed and it's not really worth the haste to get them to get them back um, so just pretty much focus your attacks don't try to spread them out anymore and you should be fine oh man now I'm slowed and I'm blind well a few of us are blind now okay apparently Novin is immune to whatever you throw at him he's somehow built an immunity to this kind of stuff there we go a critical that definitely helps they don't do very much damage, so I'm not too worried. It's just slowing down the game a lot, and I don't like that. Come on, let's pick it up. Kill him off. Let's move on. That has to do it. Thank you. So for that, we get uh, quite a bit of gill, an average amount of experience. All right. Oh, man. They just won't give up. And oh, Okay, here we go. Is it going to work the stone? Oh, no. But this is how they stone people. Um, since I didn't get a chance to show it earlier, let's show it now. Oh, don't you dare stone Finny. You want to know why I don't stone Finny? Because she's our cure for stone right now. Um, burn them with fire. So I'm going to leave this one in because it shows something new. If this kills them, I'll cure... Oh. There we go. Stone up. And he's some, I don't know, he kind of melted out of the stone. I don't know how that works exactly, but there you go. There's the most feared technique in Final Fantasy 1, stone. And what do we get here? We get the rat's tail! Seriously? The rat's tail? Yeah. Yeah, no, they're not joking. They are not joking at all. And here we get a dragon zombie. Because why not a dragon zombie? Now, what do you guys know about zombies? They are weak to light and fire. So, kill it with fire. Come on, die a three. 162 damage for the win. All right, we probably didn't need to use that, but, you know... This is pretty much the end of the dungeon, so I wanted to show it off anyways. Okay, so there we go. We got the rat's tail. This is actually the token of your valor that the other guy was going to ask for. Who's the other guy, though? You will have to find out next time. I hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.